Benny Phillip today said, and today I'm talking about 3D printing. About a week ago, I saw this video about this 3D printer who could print the, in 15 minutes, under optimum conditions, this shape. Now, it was a very basic shape. It was, you know, like a sponge-like shape, which is very wide. Now, it's not the most difficult thing to do that for the printer because it's not a lot of contact location. However, I thought the idea was pretty cool about how printers today have advanced to the point that they're actually useful. These 3D printers who used to be just kind of niche item curiosity that you could kind of do prototypes to test them out have now come to the point that you can actually manufacture small pieces which are not complicated and give them to the customer. Now, with the other advances that exist in the field, such as being able to scan and send a part, as well as being able to fax it, or scan anything and copy it, it seems to me that we're getting closer and closer to the point where 3D printers are actually a thing that will be used by the customer directly. For example, you go to a restaurant. The restaurant doesn't want to make dishes and waste that so it prints you dishes prints you a plate a fork a knife and then when you're done you throw it into the receptacle which then it gets melted back again and turned back into the material after being cleaned to make again the plates knives and forks and as such has better recycling less waste and overall better for the environment Philip that is cheating you can't just use stock reel and call that your video that doesn't count as LA. That's just not what I would count as LA. It counts like what commercials want me to think LA is. I want to see LA from your view, not from a view of that somebody else made and you buy. That's not a lie for me. And Benny, really? You forgot about the video. Really? Shame on you. Really? Shame on you. Well, Benny, Phil, I'll see you next week. I really feel like I forgot.